Hi, it's me, Lair from Girls Can, and I'm back with another Creature Feature. Today, we're going to be do doing a video on the Oleander Wasp Moth. If you remember, we did one on the Oleander Caterpillar on our Desert Rose, and we thought they were all gone until we, uh, luckily, we found a bigger, older one, and we put it in this habitat and the next day he was in a silk cocoon even though they are called the oleander wasp moth they only mimic the wasp so they cannot sting you they originate from the caribbean they they originate from the caribbean even though we found this on the desert rose we even though we found this on the desert rose, we they they um they get their name after the oleander the oleander plant and the and the, which their young feed from. And as you can see, they're very very beautiful. He was flying around earlier. <laughs> oh, there he goes. I don't know why there's a bone in there. It just is. Ah, <sighs> beautiful creatures. Um, this is a black, this is a black spotted one. They are, actually have spotted in their name. The spotted oleander, um, wasp moss. Got that part, but uh, okay. See, it is spotted, which I wish I could take it out right now. It has little yellow stripes on its abdomen. And as you all know, I, you all know butterflies have um, the tongue, which are looped. Are you sure these have it too? It looks like they do. <laughs> so that's it for today. Please like and subscribe to me and Pearl's channel. That's it. Bye.